hi guys today i'm gonna show you something it became my favorite uh, seafoods here in portugal and i don't know if uh, this kind of seafoods is all over portugal but um, in Isoris you can always find it so the name of the seafoods is lapas or limpets in english and um, you can eat it fresh or alive oh no alive yes or you can grill it you can incorporate it to your rice when you're cooking rice which is um their um uh famous uh, rice dish here in portugal the arroz de marisco or seafoods rice and it is very delicious so okay are you ready um but this kind of uh, seafoods i would like to have it or eat it fresh or grilled i like it grilled as well with uh, garlic and butter so okay i'm gonna show you how it looks like okay okay this is a portuguese uh, seafoods and this is so amazing the taste it's so wonderful and of all my travels this is i find this the most expensive seafoods that i have eaten in my entire life see this and this is like oyster you can eat it alive you know i don't know but uh i'm a kind of a person that i have to try everything i don't say no if somebody offer me to try this try that uh, when wherever i go i do because it's better to try than regret right so uh, since I started uh, eating these seafoods, I always uh, find it, uh, I always look for it first thing na darating ako dito sa Portugal, ito talaga ang hinahanap ko agad-agad dahil napakasarap niya. So I will show you now how to eat it, okay? So this is how we eat it. Look, it's alive, it's moving right the lapis is moving it is like a uh, oyster we i actually eat oyster alive you know like very very fresh back home and um yeah i really like it i like seafoods and uh, i don't know i just like anything you know that i you know whatever you know um they have wherever i go that the um if ever the somebody would offer me something to try this their delicacies or whatever something unique that you can find only in one place i never and i will never ever say no i really have to try it and look the lapis is moving look at this but oh the poor lapis i need to eat it okay so i'm gonna I actually use a spoon eating lapos and my husband is Portuguese and he is always yelling at me for using the spoon because he said that this is not the right thing to to eat this lapos but who cares you know I don't I do, I'm not accustomed of using a uh, knife you know um, eating this and eating everything you know like I'm so used of using my bare hand and and the spoon. So I don't care if this he wants to eat it using knife, then he can use. But he has to allow me using a, a spoon in eating this lapis. And look, okay, I'm gonna scoop it like this. Okay, and I will eat it. Look, the live lapis. I'm gonna put it in my. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's so so good this
this is the most delicious uh, you know um seafood seafood that i have eaten in my life and i remember one time we were at is we went to isla gigantes with my <clears throat> with my very very good friend um manang my manang teres serada and um, Nung Edgar Serada, we went to, hello guys, we went to Isla Gigantes and we found uh, the, the seafoods in there, we call it uh, scallop. And you know, abroad, you know, especially in Canada, the, the, the scallop is very expensive. And there we found the scallop and we bought a bucket of scallop for like um, less than $20. So we had it, and my husband loves it so much. And I have eaten maybe like five kilos of <laughs> of uh, uh, how do you call these scallops while you know in our entire stay in uh, Isla Gigantes. So and um, and whenever I'm in the Philippines, I sit to it. You know, we go to. Uh, when the last time we went there, we go to the seafoods in Manila in uh, Mackenzie Hill. Was it Mackenzie or yeah? Um, I don't know. You know where? Um, uh, yeah, I think it's in Mackenzie, and uh, uh, we ate a lot of oyster. I had eaten. Uh, uh, I ate like. Fresh oyster, grilled oyster, baked oyster, everything oyster. And now I'm in Portugal. I have to enjoy my lapas. So come on, join me in eating my lapas. We're gonna. I'm cleaning it with a spoon because you, you, you know, in Portugal, I wish I can wash it, but my husband will and his family will. <laughs> <laughs> will send me back to Toronto if I will wash these lapas because it's a scene, you know, in here, uh, washing lapas. So we, because this is fresh from the ocean and uh, they believe that when you wash this, you're going to take away the flavor. But I think they're right. So I just do, yeah, 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 clean it with a spoon and scoop it again. And eat it again. Mmm. Mmm. Very, very good. Come on. Eat with me. Enjoy. Okay? I'm gonna enjoy my lapos more, more, more. Mm hmm This is the big one. Big. Alive. Alive, alert, awake, enthusiastic. Poor guy. I have to eat it. Mm. 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 And then with the white wine or any wine, it's so good. So that's all for now. Bye.